Kaiden here. So today I have this mystery box. So I was just at Target the other day and you know, I was just looking around and then out of the corner of my eye, I saw this mystery box and I thought, oh, that'd be cool to show you guys to unbox and review. And then I noticed it says over $50 in original retail value. Now I'm going to see if that is true. And this is made by the Fairfield Company. So let's go in and unbox this mystery box. All right guys, so here is our mystery box. And I got this for $15.99 and it says there's over $50 in original retail value. Now, that's a little bit hard to believe because if you're buying this for $16 and you're getting over $50 in this box, that, that seems like a really good deal. And it says you can get unbox 15 awesome surprises. And again, it's made by the Fairfield Company. So let's go on in and unbox this. Looks like these flaps are kind of glued. All right guys, so I cannot open it that way because they like hot glue guns. That one flap down. And there we go. So let's take out the first item that's on top. Let's see what we have here. Ooh, okay. Oh, these are awesome. So these are the two heroes. And they're like Minecraft gamers. And get Dan TDM, Captain Sparkles, KSI. So let's go ahead and open this up. See what two hero we get. Ooh, okay, so it's been a long time since I watched Minecraft YouTubers. And see, ooh, he gets his golden sword. So let's put that together. Um, let's pretend I did not take his arm off. And let's see. Pretty sure this is Sky. Yeah. If you guys know who this is, please comment down below because I do not know who this guy is, but here was our first item in our mystery box, two pyros. Really cool. All right, now time for our second item. Now let's see, what do we have here? Ooh, okay, so these are the night before Christmas. They're Domi's collectibles. And those are really cool. So here's all your characters you can get. So let's open this up. So let's see what we get. Ooh, okay. And we got the vampire teddy. And now that is really cool. They're like in this little dome case. And it looks like you can connect your different domies. Now that's really cool. So here's our second item. All right, guys. Now for our third item. Let's grab this one right here. Ooh, okay. So this is the SpongeBob movie, Sponge Out of Water. And there's 16 different stickers, 24 different dog tags, and you can collect them all. Oh, it's a little rip. All right, so here are some of the stickers with plankton, or plankton, ton. There's the different dog tags. And this is the dog tag that we got. It looks like it's Squidward. So here's our Squidward Sour Note dog tag. It's really cool. All right guys, now for our fourth item. And looks like we got here they're called Teeny Mates, and it contains two WWE figures and two puzzle pieces. All right, so let's open this up.
All right, so here's our instruction manual. And looks like we got John Cena, and I do not know who this guy is, so let me see. Oh, okay, so he's Bray Wyatt. So we got Bray Wyatt and John Cena. Now that is really cool, and it looks like you can build a puzzle, and it gives you different puzzle pieces right here. That's really cool, so it encourages you to collect all of them. So this was our fourth item from the mystery box. All right, guys, so our fifth one here we got ooh Star Trek figures. Here's the different characters you can get. Let's see who who did we get here? So it looks like we got a, a Gorn. And oops, what is this guy? Is there a mystery? Huh, I think I might have got something special because I don't see him on the package. All right, and the third guy that we got is, let's see, that looks like Chekhov. There we go. And let's look at the instructions here. And those are the characters you can get. And for some reason, I do not, oops, I do not see this guy anywhere on the package. Maybe this guy is special. That's really cool. And <laughs> what's really funny is that this is only $1 and you get three minifigures. So that is pretty cool, especially if you're a big Star Trek fan. Nice. All right, guys, time for our sixth item right here. And let's see, ooh, we got what the Walking Dead tokens. All right, so it says there's one VR token in every pack. So I have never watched The Walking Dead, so I do not know any of these characters, but let's go ahead and just see what we get. Okay, so it gave us a lot of these tokens. And it looks like we got here like a zombie dude. Walker won 29 out of 42. We got another zombie. And we got this guy, I did not know his name. Gas mask, gas mask walker. Oh, these are like the VR virtual reality tokens. And let's see, we got this guy. And this is Meryl Dixon. Nice. So it looks like you can have a lot to collect. And me personally, I do not watch The Walking Dead, but there is all those tokens. If you like watching The Walking Dead, then these are definitely for you because they have really good weight to them and I can tell these are like really, really cool collectibles. So this was our sixth item out of the mystery box. All right guys, now on to the seventh item. And this looks like the Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 and it gets, you get one dog tag and one sticker. This is just like the SpongeBob one. All right, so you get one dog tag and let's see. Ooh, it looks like you get like a little like logo right there for the Guardians of the Galaxy. And where is the sticker sheet? 
Ooh, and this is the sticker sheet. I think this one is better than the SpongeBob one because it's like one giant sticker and you have like Star-Lord, Groot, and Rocket on there. That's really nice. And here's all of the dog tags that you can collect. I would have really liked Groot. That is awesome. All right guys, now time for our eighth package. And it's another one of those Guardians of the Galaxy. So we got Gamora, a Gamora dog tag. And another sticker. So we get two Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 packages. And now time for our ninth package. Ooh, okay, so, oh my goodness, so these are Rabbids Light Ups. Now, I used to watch the show when I was little, and I still do now, and this is gonna be really cool because I still do kinda watch this. See, ooh, so it's really thick, and I really like that picture. <laughs> it's cute. And is there any instruction? Nope. So, I do not know how you turn on. Oh, okay. So you press this button inside and it's like a little red light. You guys can kind of see that. And I don't think there's any picture on it. It's just a red light on there, but I really like this keychain. I would definitely put this on my backpack. Awesome, so that was our ninth item. All right guys, now time for our 10th item. And this right here is Star Wars The Force Awakens. And these has two, two pack erasers. And Looks like this comes with erasers, which will be really cool. I hope it's like an actual figurine and not like one of those slabs <laughs> of uh, eraser. But we'll see. Two pack erase erases. All right, let's open it up. Let's see what we get. Ooh. Okay, now this is really cool. Let's see what we got here. So it looks like we put our erasers together. All right, and it looks like we got Kylo Ren right here. And I think this is a little bit too flimsy, so I'm not gonna put it on. But here's Kylo Ren, and it's an actual eraser, which is really cool, because I thought it would not be, you know, too exciting and it's just like they just take a eraser and then they just print on the faces but they actually have a real life model and now you can actually tell who this is and this is Chewbacca Alright guys, so this is our 10th item right here, Kylo Ren and Chewbacca, really cool erasers. Alright, now time for our 11th item. Now it looks like we got here, ooh, Teeny Mates, so another one of these. And these are international soccer figures. Ooh, alright, so... Here's our teeny mates. So this guy looks like he is, oh, an Icelandic player. Nice, and this guy is a Mexican player. That is really awesome. So this is our 11th item. All right, now time for our 12th item. And ooh, we got another rabbit's light up. Got an orange one instead. 
This guy looks like he's kind of dumb. Let's see where, there we go. That's the same red light. All right guys, now time for our 13th item. Oh, it's kind of like a boxy one. And looks like we got the Batman versus Superman Hero Clicks. And it contains a pre-painted collectible miniature game piece. Let's see, we got a playing card. Batman. And, ooh, we got a Batman figure. Let's take him out of the package. This is really nice. See, it looks like you can spin something. So, I guess if you get like a Superman, you can play a game with like your cards and your figurine. All right, now on to our 14th item. And we got another Walking Dead series, Magnetic Metal Signs. All right, let's open this up. All right, these are like, Oh, they're magnets. Okay. So only comes with one. And I'm nobody really. I guess that's her seeing. Let's see who we got. Looks like we got Carol. All right, so this was our 14th item. And now on to our 15th item, which should be the last one. Ooh, and it's a box. <gasps> What a great way to end this. So these are these are Crossy Road minifigures. And there's 13 to collect. Oh yeah, and the package is like based off of the little vending machine thing that you get when you redeem your coins to try to win another character. It's a blind bag and we got Ooh. Okay, so this looks like um, this guy. This guy right here. I forgot his name. It's like the Reaper something. I, I forgot. But it's like one of those guys that you know when you're about to die, this guy shows up and leads you to the way. Darth Reaper, something like that. But that's really cool. Put that on your desk. It'll scare lots of people. Nice. All right guys, so here is all 15 of our items from the mystery box. Now, I honestly do not think this would be $50. Uh, I got this for $15.99. So basically you got a deal because I know that each one of these, they weren't $1. Even though the Star Trek was a dollar, I know this in fact, would not be a dollar. So you would be getting a deal right there because if you have $15 and if one of them, if all of them are at least $1 or over, you get a really good deal on that. And you guys should tell me which one was your favorite from all 15 of these items. I gotta say mine were the soccer players because I thought they were gonna be like actual soccer players like on the name, but they're actually country players. And I would really like to collect more of these with the Icelandic dude and the Mexican dude right there. I think that's really cool. And one thing that I did not like on these were kind of like the dog tag ones. Like, for example, the SpongeBob one. Don't get me wrong. I did watch a lot. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I did watch a lot of SpongeBob. And I remember seeing this movie. But honestly, I don't think the stickers are too great. Either they're not the best quality in the world, and the the dog tag, sure, I kind of like it, but you can kind of tell that it's not, like, the best thing in the world, um, besides on quality, but it does feel really smooth. I think this one was my least favorite right here, and I think the most valuable one here was the, the domes. Now, I can tell because it's really high quality, and when I was at Target, there's like a package of the domes, and 
I just thought, oh, that's pretty expensive for this one figurine, but I can see why it's really nice painted right there. And I guess the Domes Company, they make different, or Domies, I'm not sure which one is which, but I like to call it Domies. Um, they do make other stuff like Fortnite and also like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. If you guys are interested into that, please comment down below if you want to see me unbox some of these domes. And this was only $1. This was surprising because I thought, oh, these are really nice figurines, but they're actually $1 each. And I'm not sure about this dude right here because he wasn't in the the little instructions booklet. It didn't show that he was in there. So maybe I just got a special one, which is really cool. But what's really sad is that there's a singular air bubble in his head, which <laughs> it's not too big of a deal, but I just wanted to point that out. And I honestly think that this is a good deal. It's definitely not worth $50, I'd say, but they are still really nice. Really nice products right here. Uh, the Crossy Road, though, I forgot this guy's name. I'm pretty sure it's like the Reaper. And if you know, please comment down below, because I do not know. <laughs> but they do have different mystery box, uh, mystery boxes. There was a another blue one, and there's a pink one. I think the pink one is for girls, and they also have this brown one. And I'm guessing it's supposed to like represent a paper bag. So I thought this one would be cool to show you guys. All right guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give me a like, subscribe, share this video with your friends, turn on post notifications so you never miss a video from me. And most importantly guys, thanks for watching, bye.